Hello, hello, my lovely YouTubers. So excuse the lighting and excuse um, my huge under eye bags and lack of makeup. Um, I just got home and I just showered um, and I wanted to make a quick haul video because I got a few things that I'm loving and I wanted to share with you guys. So the first thing I got was this. This is the Makeup Forever Aqua Black, and it says it's a waterproof cream eyeshadow. And um, I don't use this as an eyeshadow. I haven't been using this for an eyeshadow. I might try it and, like, smoke it out, but I've been using this for an eyeliner, and I have it on right now. I don't know how much you can see it, but it's totally there. Um, and I've been using an angled bl brush to apply it. There's the angled brush. And this is just the Essence of Beauty. Cute. So everything in my MacBook, it's like reversed in the camera. So if anyone knows how to unreverse all the writing, like comment below and let me know because that's really annoying. So yeah, just a slanted. And I just use, I do this and I just dab it on my, my waterline and it stays. So this is what it looks like. There's like a little stopper thing. So that's what it looks like. It's like black. It's black, black, black. It's really, really creamy. Um, and it doesn't dry super fast. So you can kind of like manipulate it, which works out really well. So this is Makeup Forever. Um, I went to a party with some of my friends this weekend. And I put this on at like 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And I was a bad girl and I didn't take my makeup off that night or my eye makeup off that night, which is really bad. Don't do that. So when I woke up the next morning, most of this was still on. It wasn't on my waterline anymore. It lasted through the night, but then when I woke up the next morning, it was gone, which is fine. So I didn't reapply it or anything, and then I went swimming. And uh, even after swimming, it didn't, you know, leave me with raccoon eyes. You know, it was faded, but it was still kind of there, which is fabulous. So I'm really happy with this. Um... I wanted to find a um, good, eye, like, waterproof eyeliner. I basically use two eyeliners. I use Revlon's Colorstay eyeliner, and I use Max. I think it's Prunella eyeliner. And it's purple, and it's an eye coal, and I love it. I love the color. It goes really well with my eyes. Um, but I was really looking for something that was waterproof, and those melt and leave me with the, you know, the raccoon eyes. So I didn't like this. So I have some photo shoots coming up that um, are going to be at the beach, and I'm going to be in the water and getting wet. So I'm gonna really put this to its t um, through its paces and really test it out. It's kind of expensive. It's twenty two dollars, um, but it is so far I love it. It's a good product. They also have the Aqua eye pencils that are eighteen dollars, I believe, um, and this is from Sephora. So uh, we also went to Mac. And I ended up getting the Naked Honey Honey Solve stuff. And I love this. Um, none of you know this about me because I haven't shared it with you yet. But I'm obsessed with Vaseline. I put it on as soon as I get out of the shower. I put it on my lips. As soon as I am ready for bed, I put it on my lips. I'm obsessed with Vaseline. And I thought this would just be a fun product to try just because it's like Vaseline but it smells nicer. And it's more compact. Like I can throw this in my bag and take it with me. Also, the other day after swimming in chlorine, I had some dry skin, and I just put a little bit on it, and it worked great. You know, it wasn't a residue. It smells great. Um, it has, it doesn't really have any tint to it when you, like, put it on your finger. It's just kind of shiny, which is nice, but I love it. I really do. I'm in love with it. Um, I want to just stop for a second and let you know that most of the stuff I own isn't from MAC, um, I believe that you can find good quality makeup not um, that's not MAC, and you don't have to spend that much money. But there are some things from, from MAC that I really do like, and I really do like some of their pigments, and I really do like some of their products. So I do shop at MAC, but I also have a MAC Pro card. So I do get a discount. So like originally this was $18.50, and I got it for $13.50. So that's part of the reason why I shop at MAC. But just to let you know, I'm not one of those gurus that all of my makeup is MAC. I have a wide variety. I only own, like, maybe five things that are MAC. So I like MAC, but I really don't shop there all that often. So that was a side note. 
What else? Oh, we went to this place called Lomans. This is non-makeup, but it's really cute. So I got a skirt. And it's like a long, kind of like foofy skirt. It has a belt. So Lomans, for those of you who don't know, go online and look it up. It's, um, it's a really cool store. It's like Filene's Basement, only all, it's all designers. And it's a little bit cheaper than Filene's Basement, too. Uh, so, for instance, this skirt was originally $179, or $78, you can see right there. And then the Lomans price was basically $60. And then, you can't really see it on the tag below, but then they reduced it even further to $40. But where I was on that day... Um, the purple tags were all 50% off. So I ended up getting this for like $20. It's super cute and it's going to look really cute with a, um, like a purple tank top or green tank top. Um, just out shopping. Really cute skirt. So so the last thing that I have, um, I actually didn't buy. My boyfriend bought it for me. Um, and it's this pink makeup container. And I love it. I think it's so cute. And I think he's so cute for getting it for me. Um, I know he's watching this video, so, uh, it's, uh, he saw that I had a problem because all of my makeup is currently being housed in a tackle box, which was a really good idea and a really good way of storing my makeup until, um, my makeup kind of outgrew the tackle box. So I needed something bigger, but I didn't want to invest in drawers because I'm going off to college and I don't really have that kind of space. So this is relatively small for the most part, and it holds a lot. So this is from Ulta, and it was originally, again with like the sales, it was originally like 50 or $60, and he got it for I think like 25 or 29 He might have gotten it for 29 But it was a really good price, it was a really good deal, and it was a really good gift, and I really appreciated it. So let me adjust the angle so you can, I can open this for you. Do you guys like country? I'm wearing my uh, Rascal Flats um, tour t-shirt. So it opens like this. It has two clips on the top and then these drawers pull out. And you can see there's a lot of space. I don't really need these. Um, there's a lot of space in there. Let me tip this up for you. So that's the space. And it comes with keys so you can you can lock your makeup up. So let me just close this real quick. And it's compact. It's compact. It has two clips. And that's it. That's all I got on my little mini haul. Um, I have a few other hauls coming up. Another Alta haul. And I think that's it. I think I just have another Alta haul. But if I have another haul, you guys will just be surprised. So I hope you enjoyed this. Um, let me know if you tried out any of these products. Um, and let me know what you think. I will be posting a review on this after I kind of put it through its paces. So if you've tried it, again, let me know. Put a comment below. Um, I just posted a hair care tutorial because I know... Um, everyone's really interested in my hair. So I posted a hair care tutorial um, and that was a request and hopefully I will be posting a uh, a diffusing, sorry, a diffusing, how to use a diffuser. Um, as you can see I don't really use a diffuser. I just kind of go all natural and let it dry, air dry. So this is my haul video and I hope you enjoyed it. It's really late at night so I'm gonna edit this real quick if I have time and then I'm gonna hopefully post it so you guys can enjoy it as much as I do so I hope y'all have a great day night you know wherever you are different time so I hope you have a fabulous life I'll talk to y'all later bye